Like, I was thinking just cutting across there, but there might actually be enemies there who will see me. So I'm gonna go back the way Outrider wins. Running. Uh, in fact, let me come over here and I see if there's anyone in this direction. They have a patrol moving here. Ah, they're there. Okay. See, that's why we took it more carefully. Everything's fine. So we want to see if there's anyone over there. As you order, Commander. I reckon anyways, really can't see anyone. Moving out. So we can see those things. As soon as we break open the door, they'll know we're here. I'm gonna like just run Got up. Covered. I'm pretty sure this is clear. Alright, you're gonna go there. Alright, once we open this door, they're gonna know we're here. Opening the door. Hacking! Uh, there's a 10% chance that it opens without triggering the security protocol. <laughs> if we bought a specialist, this might be a lot higher, this chance. Anyway, doesn't really matter. Oh, what a tease! <laughs> Alright, so there's our Fire exit point. Is in position and the compound is on full alert. Time to move. We're uh, indeed. Our extraction points is back there, which is pretty close. Alright, let me come over here. I'm on the move. A soldier over there. I'm just gonna overwatch. Come get some. You are still invisible. Where should I go? I think I'll risk getting revealed. Just to give Jane Kelly a, uh, a second line of defense. Oh wait, she is revealed. I thought she was still in co still concealed. Death to the invaders. <laughs> I thought we don't get concealed. We don't get revealed. All right, that too hot. turret missed. Oh, that's not good. Advent reinforcements inbound. The compound has reached maximum alert status. They put out a distress signal and we're already picking up multiple inbound transports. Alright, we're gonna pick him up. I think we can just <sighs> run out of look. here. Look, they're gonna drop in over there. I'm gonna run out to here. It's possible next time we can just run away and not have to fight anyone else. Right, watch this. I'm gonna come over here. You... How close is it? No, it's not quite close enough. You know what? I'm just gonna run as far as possible. And you... I'm gonna shadow... I was born in the shadows. To regain concealed... And then I'm gonna run over here. I understand. Alright, so the enemy reinforcement is gonna drop in there, and I'm just gonna run for it and not even fight these guys, I think. What are they gonna do? 
Well, there's only two guys. Maybe we should fight them. Because <laughs> there's only two of them. <laughs> Ah, uh, see? See how stupid they are? So because I'm over here, they run that way into cover. Oh, more reinforcements. Alright, we're gonna... So, the, the turn that they spawn, they take cover, and they don't attack. They start attacking next turn. By the time they start doing that, I'm gonna be out of here. Because we're already within range of the exit. Alright, we're gonna extract VIP secure and in position for evac. Jane and the VIP. I'm gonna come over here to the extraction square. Moving to designated coordinates. And I'm gonna consider chucking a grenade in this direction. Oh yeah, look at this. <laughs> so I'm just gonna <laughs> blow this guy up. <laughs> Boom. Oh, get right. <laughs> I'm gonna blow him up and then evac. <laughs> Later. <laughs> that was there was no reason for us to do that except to get a little bit of experience and also because it's funny. So I'm gonna come over here. I can I can see him. Let me just take a pot shot at him. Or maybe can I blow him up? No, that's not. It's too far away. There's a forty percent chance I hit him. I won't kill him. Let me just take a pot shot at him. Ah, I missed. All right, let's get out of here. I can't let that happen again. I have oh, I'm revealed. Oh no. I guess I have to leave now. My fight is over. Alright. We must leave. Our people need us. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand <laughs> is returning to base. Good job, everyone. Everything <laughs> by the numbers. Mission accomplished. I just nice. hope your soldier was not too scarred by the experience. As brief as it was. I don't know. How about your soldiers? How are your soldiers? You two would have died. <laughs> what about yours? <laughs> I join you in your concern for the poor individuals snatched from our rehabilitation center today. Their new lives were beginning, their hearts opening to the embrace of the elders. I assure you, we will get them back. The embrace of the elders. I love that speaker. Successful shot percentage 0%. <laughs> We didn't hit anything. <laughs> Zero. Wow. All right. Good job, everyone. Good mission. <laughs> we killed nobody. Well, we killed two people. It wasn't easy, we didn't shoot but anyone. Mox has been safely returned, Commander. He's eager to get back into the fight. Bond available. Okay. Well, we don't have the facility yet. So she blew someone up, and now she is uh, gonna promote demolition. Unleash a volley of bullets at your target's cover, significantly damaging or destroying it. Deals no damage to your target. So this only destroys cover. Suppression fire a barrage that pins down a target, granting reaction fire against it if it moves, and imposing a negative fifty penalty to the target's aim. I usually take suppression, but I'm not actually sure that's better. Demolition is a little more aggressive, because if one person takes out the cover, then the other people can shoot him without the cover. Suppression is less aggressive. I don't know if I should take demolition or not. Suppression is also alright. No, you know what? I hardly ever actually use suppression. I think I'll take demolition this time. I am glad to return to your service, Commander. I will not forget what you and your soldiers have done for me. Alright, welcome back, Mox. Efficiently executed and no casualties. 
You can lead the Reapers any day, Commander. Well done. You're welcome. Alright, so... <laughs> Where's the giant icon? Uh, we can't actually give them a bond at the moment. So, we have Mox back, and the most important thing we have to do right now is consider Mox's pants. Alright, Mox? I've warned the crew to stay away from the Advent lead rations. We still don't know what they're putting in that stuff. Tell me about your legs. <laughs> legs zero, legs one, legs two. Well, that's boring. <laughs> Are you really, are you sure you can't take off your pants? Torso gear, right forearm, shoulder, armor pad, and left arm, right arm. Hmm, can't take off his pants, so he's not really a team player like the other XCOM soldiers. I mean, look, well, not you. Everyone else doesn't wear pants. What? <laughs> this is pretty good. Why do, why do Mox and Outrider have to wear pants? Anyway, pants. We can't take off Mox's pants, unfortunately. This is the headquarters of the Skirmisher faction. They may look like Advent, but they sure don't act like it. Now that we've established contact, we can scan at this location to gain additional support for our cause. All right, you great. You know them as they were, the soldiers of Advent. Now they are free to choose. If you stay your course, Commander, they will stand with you until the end. Great. Commander, I believe it is time that we meet. I am Betos, first of the Freed Advent. You are safe here. Praetor Mox was new to our cause, but he believed in our people's freedom, in this alliance, in you, Commander. I shall do the same. My skirmishers stand ready. Should you need them? May our people stand united and all false gods fall. Uh, good plan. I like that. I like that, Betos. All skirmishers, all those freed from the elders' bonds, are eager to hear your orders, Commander. This is useful. Facility construction speed is increased by 25%. That sounds great. We can only activate it at the end of the month, though. Uh, decoys and deceptions, all knowledge gained by the Chosen is reduced by 33%. That's also kind of useful, but we don't really plan to have them gain any knowledge anyway, so... Never mind. If it was your intention to aggravate me further by seeking the aid of those traitorous dogs, then you have succeeded. Avenger plotting new Good. <laughs> Success. Alright, let's scan here. Resistance ring gets built in three days. Commander, we have a priority message coming through. It looks like an encoded signal from the resistance. Patching Wait. it through to your quarters now. Alright, what's this? Man, so much stuff. There's so much stuff in this game. Everything's going on at once. Hello, Commander. Hi. It would seem your recent activities have gotten Advent's attention. Our unwelcome guests are on the move. Advent has been diverting considerable resources and personnel to covert facilities across the globe. The exact details of these operations are highly classified. However, they do have one thing in common. A single word that appears in all their files. Avatar. I believe the black site we had previously uncovered to be but a part of this Avatar project. Based on what we have uncovered so far, its true scope is far greater. This project is being directed from the very top of Advent, from a source I am still unable to determine. All attempts to uncover its identity have met with failure. It is time to take a more direct approach. Though we may not know the exact nature of this Avatar project, we can still disrupt it. We must root out these hidden facilities with the help of local resistance cells, disrupt our enemy's operations, and in the process, uncover the truth. Locate the source of this Avatar project, and then destroy it. 
Were the enemy to succeed in their efforts, I am certain it would mean the end for us all. I am confident you will take whatever measures necessary to eliminate this threat, Commander. Alright, so that's the actual game, is to stop the Avatar the project. progress on this Avatar project here. If they finish what they've started, it sounds like it'll be the end for all of us. Alright, they start at 3. So the Avatar project is what we need to stop to win the game. But it's uh, it's easier if we first take out the Chosen. Oh crap, I keep clicking the wrong button. First take out the Chosen and then level up our guys. <laughs> and then we take out the Avatar project. So this thing goes up over time, but we do have opportunities to push back their progress as well by attacking their facilities. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna leave most of that until we take care of the Chosen. Alright, new to review targets. Commander, with the number of contacts we've established, we're getting requests for support from multiple sites around the world. Unfortunately, we only have the resources to respond to one of them. The decision is yours. Alright, so this one, you get 169 supply, and it also counters the Dark Tower event. The other one, we get a scientist, and we counter the Undying Loyalty. I think I do this one, because I want the scientist. I mean, money is good, scientist I think is better in the long run. Also, I think this is better to counter than the other one. Like, losing will is not that major. Setting course for Western United States. We have to be concerned about possibly encountering the Chosen again, though. Um, destroy the alien relay. Do I take her or do I not take her? Do I also keep... Kelly sniper rifle. We don't need the hacker. We're not expecting to fight robots. Sure, let's take these guys. Oh, we have sergeants. We can uh, do the other missions now. Anyway, let's launch this mission. Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. So all your soldiers are random except for Jane Kelly, which is funny. Because Jane Kelly is in the tutorial, Jane Kelly is in pretty much everyone's game. <laughs> Unless you don't do the tutorial. Whereas all the other soldiers are randomly generated. Communications relay in this area is being used by Advent to transmit critical data back to their network. The loss of that data will stop their latest project in its tracks. So we're moving in to destroy the relay before they complete the transfer. We're expecting a strong contingent of security forces. Neutralize them and secure the site. Destroy that relay at all costs. Destroy alien relay outskirts of Edmonton. Destroy the relay, neutralize all enemy targets. Oh no, pants are snowing too. The yeah, Archie Guide's cold. <laughs> the communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. I I like how you have no pants on, but aren't you cold? <laughs> Alright, let me walk around a little bit. Scout ahead with Outrider. No enemies there. No enemies there. I mean, there's definitely gonna be enemies at the relay. I can actually use the sniper to take it out from a distance. Which is uh, gonna be handy. There's not much cover there, huh? Alright, let's go to cover oh, there. Yeah. Mm. 
lights out. Let's go to cover right. there. 